Hey, all you quarantine cats and kittens. Just kidding, just kidding. Um, this is going to be a series that I'm going to do called um, Clean Tips from a Dirty Girl. So um, I just wanted to talk to you guys about some things. Um, most of you right now are washing your hands 800 times a day or using hand sanitizer and your hands are probably screaming right now, um, just like mine. So uh, what I have to give you some tips about is exfoliation and moisturizing. So um, I have this special little fun thing that I get on my thumbs and my um, uh, pointer fingers and it's probably eczema. Um, my brother and I both get it. So it's just kind of really like the skin peels back and it's gross. So it's just kind of a thing that I have. Um, but what I found that a lot of the times um, exfoliation is really the key to get things um, off your skin that looks like this, all this dry peeling skin. Um, and a lot of the times people are like, oh my God, my hands are so dry, but yet I use all this moisturizer all the time. First of all, if you're using a petroleum or Vaseline based moisturizer, initially it goes on perfect and you get a lot of moisturizing, but then your hands are super dry afterwards. Same thing for your lips. If you're using like a petroleum or Vaseline based lip uh, balm, then same thing. It's initially great, um, but at the same time, it's actually drying out your lips as it's on you. So um, what I've gone for um, is Posh. Um, I love Posh, it's awesome. Uh, I am an influencer with Posh, so just put that out there. But um, what I found is their products really work on my hands for my issues. Um, so I have a little bit of eczema, I have super, super dry hands, and um, all of this fun stuff with my skin. Um, also, I think they've done a really amazing job for my face, but we'll talk about that in another video. Um, so one of the things that people say all the time is like, oh, you look so young. I'm like, oh, thanks, you know, because I'm 40. Um, I don't think I look 40. I don't feel 40. But what you can really tell about somebody's age is their hands. So I feel like my hands are a little bit wrinkly, a little bit dry. Um, so it's really good to exfoliate the skin. This way you're getting your more youthful, uh, more supple skin underneath coming out. So um, one product that I found that is really unique to Posh is called Buzz Peel. And so this actually, you put it on your skin and I will just do kind of like a live demonstration of it right now. But what you can see is, hold on, sorry. We haven't used it in a little bit, so, okay. So you see all these delicious, um, flaky things coming off right now. That's my skin. Um, and so as I rub it into my skin, I'm getting more and more of this amazing flaky deliciousness coming off. So that's actually exfoliating all the crap off of my skin. So all my dry skin, all my old skin, I'm making a mess underneath me because all this stuff is falling off. But you can see all these little um, flakes of my skin coming off. So really good little chunks coming off. So that's the first exfoliation tool that I have for my skin. And I'll show you once all this stuff is off that this looks a bit smoother than the other one already. So um, another one that I love is their scrubs. Um, what I have open right now is called the Pink Mono body scrub. Um, their body scrubs I really use just for my hands and feet because I feel like from the whole surface of my body, it's a decent sized jar. This is actually the other size jars that they have. Um, so this is 10 ounces, I think, nine ounces. And then this is, uh, let me see, how many ounces are you? 6.7 ounces for the pink kimono. So um, I feel like it's best spent on your hands and feet because that's really where a lot of your dry skin is, right? So um, the pink kimono is by far one of my favorites. It's a really, um, ooh, I picked up the wrong one. No, yes, okay, I picked up the wrong one. Don't mind me. <laughs> so it's a really, really finely graded um, scrub. 
And so you're really gonna get an awesome exfoliation with it. Plus it smells amazing. So it's pink dragon fruit on the scrub. And it also has shea butter in the scrub. So you're exfoliating and you're moisturizing at the same time, right? So I just put a big palm there. So you're just gonna really like work it into your hands. I should have totally taken off my rings before this. Um, but really work it into your hands and especially me with my thumbs. I wanna make sure I really get in there into the skin and get that exfoliated um, dry skin off of me. Should have totally taken off my rings, but whatever, it's fine. <laughs> so, you know, it smells really good. You're getting really good scrub on your hands, getting all that disgusting dry skin off of you. And I'm just gonna use one of my delicious little handy wipes here to get this off. So you take this off with the scrub. There you go. Okay, so you take your scrub off and then you're gonna moisturize immediately afterwards. There's no need to wash your hands because you have just sloughed off all of your disgusting skin. And then, yeah, these don't work well as far as water. Water would be better. Anyway, but then you're gonna use a hand cream right afterwards. So our hand creams, each of them are three ounces. So they travel really, really well. And those of you know that I'm a big traveler. So um, they are really, really easy. And then there you go, really nice exfoliated skin. And you saw my thumb before. That's actually really super good, oh my gosh. Okay, so that's awesome. All that dead skin is off of there. I was sitting there like peeling it back in Lowe's and being gross, but like, <laughs> ah, I told you I'm a dirty girl. So, but yeah, that's a really great result on that. Okay, awesome. So our hand creams um, are made with this awesome, awesome apricot, um, whatchamacallit, Apri uh, apricot kernel oil. And they're also, a lot of them have this aloe barbatus juice, which is super, super moisturizing, both of them. And the best thing about it is that it actually does not dry out your hands. And two hours later, you're gonna still feel the moisturizing in your hands. The best part about it too, is that it's not super greasy, so that when you go to grab a door handle or something like that, then it's just gonna be like, you just didn't have any uh, lotion on your skin at all. It's not gonna slip off that door handle. So it's just gonna really kind of soak into your skin. So it's really, really, really good. Um, I want to tell you about a couple of our scrubs. So you guys already saw the Buzz Peel, which is a specific uh, thing by itself. It is technically an exfoliator, but I wouldn't group it in with the scrubs. So it's a super good one. I think that I have a couple of these, only a couple of these um, in my boutique. Welcome to my boutique, by the way. Um, <laughs> I have an in-home boutique, which is awesome. Um, I currently have four of these left, four of these left in my boutique. So if you like that little thing that your skin's coming off, it works really well for feet as well as hands. Um, I totally recommend it and I'm pretty sure it's $26. So, and a lot of their, uh, almost all of their stuff is under $25. So that's what makes it so awesome. Um, so this one's 26, I'm sure, I think so, either 26 or 24, don't quote me. Okay, but, our scrubs normally are $24. Um, what I'm doing recently is that they're 20% off, which or 15% off, which I think makes them $20. So if you're listening to this video and you're down below and you say, I want a scrub, then you're only gonna be charged the $20. Um, by far my favorite scrub is gonna be the You Had Me at Aloha. Anything that reminds me of Hawaii or pineapples or anything like that makes me super, super excited. So this is pineapple and hibiscus and it has honey, sea salt and sugar in it. So this is by far my favorite scrub. Um, I currently have one, two, three, four, five of them available. Um, so, and they're $20 each. Um, my friend Jill, she loves the pumpkin scrub. It smells like pumpkin pie. It's awesome. I think I only have one of these left, maybe two. So one or two of these left. 
Um, this is the, we put the lime in the coconut. Um, I think I only have two of these. So it's gonna be like a sassy little coconut lime smell. Um, and all of these are either made with sugar or salt. And then there's also essential oils in all of these, which is great. This is an awesome one. So this is a Rose Quartz Feminine Energy Body Scrub. It's awesome. Um, this also has like a finer scrub to it, but it's really, really exfoliating. It's really good. Um, and it's a little bit sparkly, so it's fun. Um, this one is so amazing. So this one is probably my second favorite and it's Beach Blanket. So this is a coconut citrus with a little hint of vanilla in it and it's super, super good. So it'll take you straight to the beach. It's awesome. Um, and then this really is labeled as a body scrub uh, because there's green coffee in it. Uh, and this is called All Sun and Games. This one actually is on special for $15. So um, it's a little bit smaller. It's actually five ounces. Um, and you can use it for your body. What I want to say because of the green coffee in it is you actually use it in your trouble areas where you have like cellulite and things like that. So that's super good for that one. It also will increase your circulation um, and bring blood flow to the area. So that's really good as well for your skin. Um, talking about the hand creams, I have a bunch. And let me just take you down here for a second. Okay, I have a super amount, a bunch. <laughs> Um, so I probably have like 20 different hand creams that I've had over the years. Um, a lot of them are exclusives that are no longer available or were only available for consultants like myself. So I have those. Um, this one is called Some Like It Hot. So it smells just like warm baked cookies. Um, I think I only have two of those. So, and these are $10. And right now I'm doing a promotion. If you want to donate to thank a nurse, um, then you can just comment below to thank a nurse and uh, um, send them a hand cream from you. Um, because as you know, we're all really using our uh, hands a lot right now as far as uh, lots of hand washing and sanitizer in the hospital. So um, that would be really awesome if you could donate to my little fundraiser. Um, so thank you nurse, it's just $10 for a hand cream and that would be super awesome of you guys. Um, so this one is called Some Like It Hot. So this one smells just like baked cookies. So that's really awesome. This one is Blackberry and Jasmine. This is called Social Butterfly, which was my pledge name. Don't, don't hate on the girl. I was a little sorority girl back in college, don't mind me. Um, but this one is awesome. It's called Poshy Mellow and it's sparkling sugarcane and marshmallow. Delicious, super sweet. Um, this one is Melon and Plumeria. It has a really fresh scent to it and it's just really, really nice. It's called Twilight Zoned. Do, 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 do. All right, so that was that one. This is called Sassy Yuma. It's by far one of my favorites as well. It's a really fresh citrus. It's Satsuma Oranges. So that's super good, really fresh, delicious scent. Um, nice Melons is Melon, Mango, and Strawberry. You know, Nice Melons, hello. Um, so that one is super fresh and fruity as well. I've got Brazilian Bombshell. So this is Toasted Brazil Nut, Vanilla, and also Coconut Cream. It's got a super like sexy scent is the only way I can really describe it, but it's like jungle fruits and sugar cane and like you just put it on and you kind of get in the mood i'm not gonna lie i had one um friend yell at me because her husband won't stay away from her when she has that on so it's really funny um but anyway <laughs> um beach blanket again is gonna be just like that scrub so it's gonna be coconut citrus with a little hint of vanilla this one smells super good um my by far favorite is called Trop the Beat. So it's just like the Aloha scrub. It's gonna have pineapple and hibiscus. And it's just gonna be that like Hawaii and a hand cream kind of scent to it. Um, also we have Show Me What You're Mermaid Of, right? Little hint on words. If you can't tell that all of these are like punny words, um, they're super cute names. So this one is Melon and Coconut. And it's just, this one also has a really, really nice fresh and fruity scent. 
Um, Warm Welcome was our uh, kind of holiday one. And there's bergamot, uh, holiday spice, uh, orange in this one. And it's just really like kind of like a warm Christmassy scent. So if you're missing Christmas, I've got, I think, just one warm welcome left. Um, Lady Limoncello. So for my limoncello lovers. Um, so sparkling Italian lemon and honey. Delicious. Um, we've got blackberry vanilla and velvet musk and what's your sign. So if you're like more of a musky person, you don't really like the fruity kind of things, then I've got one of these left. Um, Posh Boss is cassis, peony, and vanilla. So if you're more on the vanilla spectrum, but you like a little bit of floral, I totally recommend this one. And then the Gender Bender is great because this is what I give to my guys. So this is an amber and citrus. It's like truly a, kind of a manly type scent, but it's gender bender. So you can use it unisex. Um, so this one is super, super good. Um, and then by far my favorite for the fall season, because, hey, I'm a basic bitch. I don't even care. Um, this is pumpkin spice and vanilla pumpkin to talk about. I think I only have one of these left as well. So those are all the different hand creams that I currently have. There's more on the site. Um, I'll put my site below, um, or above in the comments, um, about it just so you can kind of look at all these things, but that's basically, you know, how to take care of your really super dry hands, um, clean tips from a dirty girl. And, um, if you guys have any questions, just hit me up in the comments. All right. I'll see you later. Hopefully have a great day during this quarantine and have a great weekend. All right. Bye.